Dan Blanchard and myself devised a study to look at life and diversity within eight plots in the White Hackery Ranges. Auckland Council maintains some 350 plots around the region and we decided to do a subset looking initially at um, Leptospermum and Kunzia regenerating forests. We did a literature review and we found one technique devised by somebody called Asta, which we then refined for our own purposes. We needed to be able to study um, both alpha and beta diversity and alpha diversity is the total species richness of um, lichens within a plot whereas beta diversity requires abundance data. In order to gather abundance data which we then use to build a species diversity index we had to literally count how much of each given lichen species there was. Once we get to the plot that we're going to study, we mark it out using tapes and then split the 20 by 20 metre plot into four. Within each of these four subplots, we sample the three largest trees and measure them with a DBH tape to make sure they're big enough to get our sampling grid around four sides. 20.5. So we use this grid um, that's split into five different boxes and each box is split into 25 smaller boxes, each two by two centimetres. And then within each box we look at each individual lichen species that we can find and work out a percentage cover for it. So this one up here, we'd say there's 6% cover in that. In order to get the full alpha diversity of the plot, we then had to comb over and look at any trees that we hadn't already studied and pick up any species that we haven't picked up so far. These may be things that have fallen down from the canopy or on smaller trees and once we've done this we can then build up a picture of the full alpha diversity or species richness within the plot.